Hey guys, <clears throat> day 10. I am done with my cleanse and it is awesome. I love it. So excited. Um, this has been a really, really um, long 10 days. Not because it's been particularly hard, it's just that, you know, there's been so many personal challenges and things that um, I had to get over, as well as personal victories, things that um, I didn't think that I could do. Never thought that I could go 10 days without eating food. I never thought that I could run up to the third floor of my <clears throat> college without feeling like I was going to die. And I've been going on like walks every night, and it just it feels good. It feels really good. So, I made it. <laughs> I made it. It's really awesome. And, um, <clears throat> I gotten some questions, um, but I'm going to answer all the, the Q&As in a separate video. So, if you didn't get to watch the last video, again, send me a personal message with your question about the cleanse, and, um, I'll go ahead and try to answer them to the best of my ability. Um, I'm probably going to try to get at least, you know, five or six good questions. Um, so send them my way. So 11 pounds. It's awesome. Tonight, okay, so today I had, um, three, no, was it four? I had four servings of the lemonade. And then I had a glass of apple juice. I know they say orange juice, but we didn't have any orange juice. Um, so we had apple juice. So I had a glass of apple juice. And then um, I just had some ice water. Um, and then I made some iced tea. And then around 6 o'clock, um, I made some rice. And it was really good. It's just regular plain white rice. I didn't have brown rice or anything like that, so I used what I had on hand. Um, and I only had like a half a cup, and I felt full. I mean, you know, I haven't been eating solid foods for over a week, and so my stomach, my stomach has shrank, you know? I felt full after like a half a cup of rice. It's crazy. So, and then for a snack, I had um, an orange was like just a little mandarin orange and it was good um just trying to drink water and juice um tomorrow i'm gonna make my soup that's gonna be really good um oh i played around with a new um eyeshadow technique it looks like snake skin i'm not i'm not sure if you guys can tell but it's my snake skin look it's really easy too, and uh, I'll be showing that in a separate video. So you guys, are, you you makeup chicas out there are probably like, "Damn her!" All I'm gonna tell you is that it's a lot easier than it seems, and it takes me like less time than it does to get out all my crazy brushes and like do it up you know what I mean like it's really quick so that's my little my sneak skin look um I'm gonna continue on my wellness journey that's what I'm calling it my wellness journey I'm gonna continue to push the envelope physically as to my normal like physical activities like today we went for a walk and we went a block further than we normally do you know maybe next time we'll go two blocks farther than we normally do <clears throat> but now when I have Jackie with me I have to be careful because she's three and she gets tired even before I do you know her little legs what, what, what takes me two blocks to walk for her probably feels like four or five so you know I'll save my personal triumphs for when she's not with me. But we did go a little farther than we normally do. We had Zoe with me. So we were, you know, walking the dog. And we walked up to the football field, but they were having um, a game. And she was. we stopped because she wanted to watch the cheerleaders. 
<laughs> and they're middle school kids, so she thinks it's cool because they're, you know, big girls, as she calls it, but they're only like, you know, five years older than her, really, five or six years, anyways, um, so that was fun, so I'm going to just continue to do the right thing, you know, eat right as much as I can, I'm telling you right now, I'm not going to give up my Chinese food, no way, but instead of having it like once a month, I'll probably have it like every couple months, you know, but I got to have my cashew chicken and my egg roll, so back off, <laughs> um, and just, you know, take care of myself in general, um, you know, 11 pounds isn't a lot, but it's given me the motivation that I need to lose another 11 pounds, get down to my goal weight. You know, I don't really have a goal weight, I have a goal size. And my first goal, I believe in setting smaller goals so that they're more attainable, is to get to a 14. And then after that, maybe I'll try for an 8, you know. So it's just little changes make a big difference, and that's the part that I want to instill in all of you. It's not a diet. <laughs> I did lose 11 pounds, yes. But I think what I lost in pounds, I gained in motivation and self-esteem. And that, to me, is worth more. And it sounds really corny and Hallmark card, but it's true. I learned a lot about myself the last 10 days. I learned that even when you don't think you can do it, you got to push yourself, and you can. Day three and day four, there were moments where I thought, you know what, this is stupid. I'm not even, what, what is this going to prove? I need a snap, a snack, you know? And I talked myself out of it. I gathered the strength in myself to just do it. And you can do it too. Nothing is stopping you. And I'm going to use a an old saying that my mom used to say all the time. She still says it. There's nothing between you and your dreams but fear and air. That's it. You can do it. So if you think you can't, take a look at yourself and think of all the things that you've done that you didn't think you could do and then chalk this up as one of them because you can do it. That's it. It's that simple. I didn't think I could do it, and I did it. So, that's it. I'm going to quit being all preachy and inspirational and like motivational and just say, you can do it. My hair, that's a whole other thing. I don't think I can tame this beast. But, <laughs> I can change myself, and that's what's important. And you can change yourself, too. So, thank you for all your support. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe because I'm going to have more videos. I'm going to have recipes, things that I'm doing. I'm going to keep you guys updated on my weight loss journey and things like that. And um, I have a couple little side projects going on that I'm going to fill, fill you guys in on later. I'm still going to bring you guys fabulous makeup looks. And that's it. I'm just going to keep on being me, but I'm going to be a better me. That's it. So thank you for watching, guys, and have a good night.